one thing to consider is the size of the potentiometer. So for instance, if the current potentiometers and the routing is cut for a smaller size, the, the new potentiometers are not going to fit. So one way to kind of um, measure it is to use some calipers. This is the old set, or I should say the old potentiometer, and it's measuring roughly about 0 0.303 on this caliper, where the, the new ones are gonna read roughly 0.38. So it's definitely, this is like a 3.8 size, so this one is gonna be a little bit larger. So what we can do, um, if you're comfortable doing this, you can get what they call a reamer, and what we can do is we can actually measure, uh, first get the reading on this guy here. So I have the measurement of the new pot right here, and I have it locked in. So what I'm gonna do is I'm take my reamer, and then I can actually measure it, and then mark with the Sharpie where that needs to go. So basically what, we're, what we need to do is we need to put this reamer in the hole and we need to carve it out so it enlarges the the hole a little bit. The reason why we use a reamer is because it's going it's not going to chip and fray the hole especially if you have a nice finish on your guitar. You don't want to use a drill bit because it can actually ruin that finish and chip and everything. So they also have what they call step up bits and a few other things, but the reamer is a nice kind of tool because you can do it by hand, you can go slow. If you don't have a caliper, if you're very careful, you can route out just a little bit and until, uh, and then check it with the pot until it's large enough to, for, for the pot to fit. So since we were able, since we have some calipers here, we were able to mark uh, the, the reamer off where we need it to be. So what we're going to do is we're just going to open up this hole a little bit and we're going to come from the top side of the guitar and we're just going to rotate clockwise and we're going to go real slow. Since we have the marking there we know not to go past that marking on the reamer and uh, again you can just go real slowly and then pull it out and then you can take the, the new pot check to see if it's large enough um, and then do a little bit more. But again, it's best if you can measure it because then that'll give you the most accurate and you'll know exactly where to, that you, where to, how big to open it up and not going too far. So again, I'm just going real slow. There we go. So I'm just checking here, the new potentiometer fits nicely and snug in the new hole. Again, this was done using the reamer and a set of calipers.